Whoa. Welcome to the charge. I'm Sir Franklin, and we're taking to the field today with the next part in our Alan Wake game through. Let's ride. If you're overwhelmed by enemies, try to run into the light. I try that, today, and I think I, I got my butt kidnapper. kicked anyways. And he would give me Alice. I wouldn't give him any other choice. A drowning man will clutch at a straw. Uh-huh. Oh, I can drive. That's kind of nice. This is a really pretty setting, Even minus all the death. Without realizing it, I'd come to believe that the story in the manuscript was coming true. The current of its narrative had taken me deeper and deeper into dark waters. Alice had been taken from me. Barry was probably in jail. I was a fugitive from the FBI. The whole world taken over by the dark presence was trying to destroy me. It all felt real, but it matched a textbook case of insanity. That could be it. We could just be going insane and going on a mass killing spree. Not great. I don't know if we have... I keep forgetting we can jump. I don't know if we have any weapons right now, do we? We don't. That's good. Just going to meet a kidnapper in the dark. In a coal mine without anything. Do we go this way, or... Oh, I lost a lot of health. Oh, why did I do that? I could have just gone around. <laughs> oh, why did I do that? All right, well, I guess we'll see what happens. I know your health can regenerate up to three quarters. If it's daytime, is it going to regenerate all the way? Because that's how they do it. There's, you know, you get healed by the light. That would be convenient <laughs> after I just kind of did that to myself. I want to see what's up here. I don't think that's the way we're supposed to go. But, there might be a page or a thermos of coffee. I have no idea what I'm doing, apparently. Oh no, this was the right way. Okay. Looks like our health is capped at three-fourths. This is Pat Main, and you're listening to KBF-FM. Folks, I want to apologize for kind of... Can we drive again? We can! There we go. So a little bit of walking, a little bit of driving. Along the scene, a crowd. Oh, yikes. I do not have a lot of traction in this. Come on, get over the hill, get over the hill. Keep going. This car is struggling to get up this hill. Come on, you're almost there. You are almost there. All right, let's stop here, and then we can take that sweet-looking... Look at that. Another checkpoint. So a lot of this is just kind of outside and getting there. Welcome back to KBF FM. Hope you enjoyed that, too. Now, Doesn't Doc, do anything, does it? about life and finding that special someone, that soulmate. Well, you were talking about that. Oh, sorry. I was saying I don't buy it. Well, see, to me, that's strange because I... All right, back on the road. I guess there's nothing really important here. Unless we open the porta potty Nope. That is going to be a mystery. Excuse me. There we are. Hopefully this car is a little better. I'm probably committing a ton of gr I mean, I am committing a ton of Grand Theft Auto right now. But that's alright. <sighs> I know we keep stopping. But I can't help it. I'm sick in the head and I have to explore everything. You can always see old abandoned trucks. Would have been cool to actually drive one of those. That chest is bigger than us. There's a body in there. There's gotta be. Can we not go up further? Oh. Oh, we were out of stand. Manuscript page. There we go. Vermont. Spying on the writer on the ferry had been a disappointment. His boss had made Wake Out to be something special. But Maude hadn't been impressed. 
He'd gotten a good long look up the wife, though, and he liked what he saw. Well, it's a little creepy. He's into Alan's wife. Oh, yikes. But it seems like what he really wants is a fight with Alan. For whatever reason. And on we go. I kind of like it. It's a little more open world right now. Which I don't I don't mind linear games. Uh, I, I like them to an extent, but it is nice if they're kind of mixing some of this in where you have a little more um, a little more freedom to move about. Oh shit! Oh shit! No 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 go go go! No. Are we stuck? It was not my fault. My insurance is not gonna cover this. That's not good. Bright Falls Coal Mine. I definitely read that as Bright Coal Falls Mine. Well, at least we got here. Definitely nothing bad happened. No damage to any I was early. property. I was supposed to meet the kidnapper at noon in the main building. The coal mine was quiet. It was a museum now. I didn't want to go outside. Cops had to be looking for me. The new sun turned the place into a sauna. The day dragged on. Different scenarios ran through my mind. Ways of how I'd torture the kidnapper to get Alice back. Or the different horrible things he could have done to her. I imagined her dead. I had no way of knowing she was still alive. It was killing me. <laughs> I was running on blind hope. I get it. It was all a waste of time. The bastard never showed up. Ah, uh, now we have all our stuff. Yep. Where the hell are you? Change of plans. You know where Mirror Peak is? It's a big mountain north of where you are. You follow the path from the mine, you can't miss it. There's a lookout point. I'll be waiting. I'm through being jerked around you by you. You want to see your wife alive? Because if you do, you better watch what you say to me. Do we understand each other? I want to talk to Alice. Yeah, and I want the manuscript. Don't keep me waiting, Wake. Hello? Hello? Ah! I'm going to kill him. He does seem I like he sucks. to Mirror Peak. Ooh! Maybe closer than ever before. Well, that's good. Before I use that, let's grab some of these other items. Oh, thermos! Nice. The flares, batteries are cool, revolver ammo is cool. We have the shotgun. I'm gonna hold off on that if we can. And I haven't seen any other manuscript pages, but I could have missed one coming up since the area was a little larger. But, is what it is. Alright, I think that's everything. Let's go ahead. This kind of exploration, I think I mentioned it before, it seems cool to me. But also just really dumb, especially if you don't go with a group. Seriously, take people with you. Be safe. You're gonna do something like this. Oh, there's a page. When Thomas Zane fell for Barbara Jagger, it happened fast. She was young, vibrant and beautiful, full of life. He had never been a very happy man, and without any seeming effort, she had changed all that. Oh yeah, and Barbara's the old woman that we see represent the darkness. Because that's not actually Barbara. Okay, we're full. Plenty of ammo. This is absolutely a boss fight. Oh, 
bad aim, bad aim, bad aim. Yikes. All right, not my best work. I probably sh should have used the flare some. That's all right, we have a ton of ammo though that we can come back to. The hell? Oh, this again. I forget the objects can hurt us now. Like, random metal stuff can fly up and just hit us if it wants to. Like that. Okay. Flashbangs. Nice. I think it's one of the bumpers to use those. Ow! Ow! I need to get better at dodging. I am not in a good habit of that right now. Gonna screw me up. What a lovely haunted scenario. I'm just trying to... There it is. Come on. Okay, it's not like I can do much to him right now. Weird. I know that the cart's in the way, but it sounded like we were able to hit him. Do I want to open that? I don't, but I think I have to. Can I just... Where you at? Hold on. Calm down. Okay, there's one. You know what? I landed on it. Of course I did. Holy crap. Kind of messed us up there. Jeez. Alright, we can get up to three quarters of our health at least. We're gonna have to find some light though. What the hell? Okay, so that's what the darkness looks like. At least we know now. Um Guess we can't really do anything else, can we? Alright. That's where we came out of. There's nothing there. Guess we head down here. The only way to reach the hillside ahead was to go through the building. I had to find a way to avoid electrocution. Maybe just drive? Let's take a look around here, though. I feel like this isn't a good idea. That some guys are going to pop out. Yep, there they are. Oh, there's a lot! Okay, hey, got one. You know what? Ow. Okay, got some. Did not see you. Well. Jeez. Okay. I had to use a lot. That last flashbang I didn't use really well. That just got one guy. 
probably should have shot some of these explosives, but it's just the kind of smooth operator I am. I also could have used the car to get over here. I think I'm going to do that because I don't know if I'm going to need that to get back over here or not. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's kind of position it there. There we go. Okie dokie. And we got a checkpoint. Nice. Let's get some more ammo. Flare. It's fine. Those are all well and good. We gotta drive, we gotta get back and drive. Whoa! Not worth it. <laughs> oh, Alan, you gotta learn to run faster, man. Okay. Not bad. We definitely did need the vehicle. I'm glad I went back and got it. Uh, it was a little stressful. Pop off some batteries, revolver ammo, very nice. Ooh! <laughs> hey, bud. I need, I need the big guy. There we go. There we go. Get wrecked. And we're safe. I'm glad they are kind of... They're keeping us stocked at least. Not a lot of manuscript pages. Or I could just be missing them. I don't know. Getting the hang of it again. Getting back into rhythm. It just kind of happens if you don't play a game every single day. Even if you take one day off, you know what I mean? Trust no one in the dark. No shit. Alright. You need to climb up. Is there anything else that we can grab while we're around here? No? Okay. At least we're at full health. Uh, we do have the shotgun. So if we run out of ammo on the revolver, we should be fine. And we're maxed out on batteries. And we have some flares left. Honestly, pretty good. Oh, and there's a manuscript page. Thermos. Again, don't know what that does. Some of the Taken retained echoes of their former selves. But these were just the nerve twitches of a dead thing. Nothing remained but a shell covered and filled with darkness. In most cases... The well... I feel like something bad's about to happen. What is... Is that a light mounted on the truck? That's pretty nice. Ooh. Not good. Oh, wait. Hold on. Alright. Okay.
There was no way the flashbang grenades were standard power company equipment. Well, no, it's probably because we're getting help to get over to the kidnapper. You know, I thought he was like a friend at first, but he kind of sucks too, the kidnapper. Not that like a kidnapper would be a friend, but you know what I mean? He saved us at first. We didn't know he was the kidnapper. Am I just not going the right way? Am I supposed to go some other way? Or do I drive the truck, maybe? I'm a little confused. No. I don't know if it's important to clear the little patches off, but it makes me feel better. I don't think there's... I don't know, maybe there's an achievement for it or something. I okay. guess we're going this way. Look at how efficient we're getting. Yep, 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 big boy. Um... Oof. Oh, that was almost really bad. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on. <laughs> Is he... Okay. I didn't know that he was uh, unshadowed. I don't know what to call that, but at least we're kind of getting our rhythm again getting through these guys. They're a little intimidating, especially when there's like five or six people trying to beat the shit out of ya, but it's nice to be done with it. We might have to... You know what? No, I want to keep using the revolver as long as I can. We may have to switch to the shotgun at some point. We'll see. Did have to use a flare, which I don't think I used it as well as I could have. Alright, what you got for us? I stared through the bars of the jail cell. Barry stood behind me, swaying on his Oh feet, no, they get as us? Ill as I felt. Agent Nightingale stood on the other side of the bars with Sheriff Breaker. Raymond Charles, the guy's crazy. This FBI agent just wants to kill. Uh, we're gonna go get that thermos. I know we can walk right into the light, but I feel like that's a trap or something bad's gonna happen. Ooh. Okay, thermos first. Oh, maybe that's the kidnapper's truck. Oh! Oh, that hurt. Oh, that took out so much health. Oh, we gotta be safer than that. That was not smart. No, because mirror points down that way. We have to walk down there. Okay. Let's try this again, except not being an idiot this time. Stay jumping on the cover. No, 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 no! Nice. So happy that killed us. Maybe the thermos isn't worth it. Alright, let's go see what's in the mine first, at least. Seems like there's something that could help us. Maybe some ammo or something like that. Yeah, look at that. Flashbangs, yes. How many do we have now? We have a ton of flashbangs. We're going to keep those handy. Ah, probably for right now. 
Think I'm afraid of y'all? Ow. Nice. Still came out positive there. Just let me get the thermos. Please. We did it. Well done, gentlemen. And there's our checkpoint. Oh, those weren't head beams from a car. I'm an idiot. It was just a lamp post. Jeez. All right. Cool. Oh, the game's being too nice. It's giving us a lot of stuff. All right. I had no real plan. I was going to give the kidnapper all the manuscript pages I had for Alice. If that wasn't enough, I'd hold him at gunpoint and make him talk. I absolutely want the pump instead of the um, other one. Oh, they can go in that light, apparently. Okay, so it won't kill them, but it'll break the shadow on them. Okay, just need to remember the flashbang. Nice, there we go. I see a thermos, maybe there's a manuscript page over here. Guys, come on. We're doing so well. Flare gun ammo, nice. Shotgun ammo, very nice. I didn't even know we could get any more. 32. Ah! Ooh! Okay, shotgun time. Well, oh, crap, there's a lot of them. All right. I think we should just get out of here at this point. Because I think they just keep spawning. Yep. Ow. Okay. do this but you already he was already ready to be shot all right we're getting out of here this is kind of getting rough uh oh 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 there's a lot Two flashbangs for that. I think that was... I think that was good. I think that was a pretty good trade, actually. Or was I supposed to go up this way? I guess so. Alright. 
Yikes, we do not have any revolver ammo. We got one round left. Oh good, we're on a, a graveyard. presence was moving ahead of me in the same direction I was going. A cold feeling settled itself in the pit of my stomach. Was it going for Alice? Not good, because it's kind of keeping us held up with all these guys we gotta kill. The graveyard shift may cause cancer. What? Sorry, my guy. I'm sure you were a nice dude. But apparently, I'm just a cold killer now. Alright. Oh, we should turn that on. I don't know how. Maybe it's in this little shack. No? There you go. And freshen up on some batteries. We're gonna have to start getting creative pretty soon. Um, the shotgun's nice, but... We still have to use it for all the fighting now. And we're gonna run out of shells soon. No? Oh. The place was dead. A ghost town. Had been for decades, maybe a century. What? Uh oh. Dang! Whoa, that took out a lot! Okay. Guess we gotta keep that in mind. I need, I need to get better about dodging the objects. I'm kind of back on track again with dodging, you know, the guys, but not a full car getting hurled at us. Things were never as simple in real life as in fiction. I had lost count of the times I had wished there'd be a clear reason for my writer's block. Something to fight, something to lash out on. There wasn't. I was filled. Okay. Oh, is it giving us full health? Or it's letting us regen our full health? That's pretty nice. I don't want to waste this chance to get more ammo if we need it. So I do want to check out the ammo in there. Right. Because again, we have the shotgun and plenty of shells for now, but that could go fast, I guess, depending on how I use the rest of what we have. Are these all objects about to... Yep. Got my eye on you. Okay. See, now that we're actually dodging and not getting hit by flying metal uh, that's larger than us, I think. 
Oh, maybe I lied. I hate fighting random objects. I mean, you can, I guess you can fight them better than you could by shooting them since we have the flashlight, but still, it's enough to be a little stressful. Maybe we get off of this. We're gonna fight more objects. I dodged into it. No, no. Dude. Wow. Okay. All right. A little annoying. Let's see if the flare gun can do anything here. we go okay when did we get more revolver ammo i wonder if we get some automatically at a checkpoint i don't know key all right and a thermos you can't hide from me i've been meaning to look up what the thermoses do in this game. Maybe they're unlockables, maybe they're cheats if you want to, you know, do a later playthrough. I'm not sure. Flare gun ammo is nice. Anything outside of riding is a struggle. I feel ill. I managed to make my way downstairs. There's a shoebox filled with books and papers by Thomas Zane. It's very hard to focus, but I managed to read some of it. He's a poet, and a good one. He writes of music. Hunting rifle instead. Summoning fabulous Should I? Things from a magic lake, using his power right. to shape the world of a realm of gods and dreams and demons, dark things that wait for a chance to slip through, wearing the flesh of men as disguise. Creepy. Zane writes about himself, his girlfriend being taken over by a dark presence, about growing scared of the lake. Zane believes it's a mirror to the gaping void of darkness. Oh, that does not sound good. Guess we continue this way. It, it, I mean, it gave us the option for the rifle. I don't know if the game was trying to help us out or not. That's why I swapped it, but I wonder if I'm going to regret that. Because we still had plenty of shells left with the shotgun. Um. The kidnapper had sent me a text. The message was full of spelling errors and insults. It was telling me to hurry up. Full of spelling errors. <laughs> I checked his grammar. It was bad. It's just, uh, it's just heavy breathing. Okay, the flashbangs seem to me to be, like, the best weapon in this game. But that's... I guess that depends on who you're fighting. Because they can... I guess it's similar to the, uh, flare gun. But still, it's kind of hard to say. Y'all go away... Are y'all gonna attack me? Uh oh. There you are. 
Oh, the flare gun. Right, 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 right. right. Y'all wanna do this? There we go. Ooh, nope, 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 nope. You're tricky. Ah, okay. <laughs> Yep, we're just gonna keep running. Okay, I'm guessing we're safe from the birds now. Had to use... How many flares did we use? We used three or four. A dead end. If we get attacked in here, it's gonna be a little tough to deal with. I guess we can create distance with the flares, though. That's our best bet. Tunnels go to Cauldron Lake. All right. I don't like hearing our name whispered. <laughs> don't know if we're going the right way or not. I did kind of want to see if there were secrets, things like that, but I guess more flares. Oh, there's a manuscript page. All right. Even behind the closed doors and curtains of his grimy room at the Majestic, the local motel. Nightingale could feel the locals' eyes on him, the unrelenting pressure of their judgment. He forced it. Oh man, he so he thinks he's the he thinks he's the savior here. And we think we're the savior. I wonder who's right. All right, big boy. Managed to do that without using any of the hunting rifle, uh, but maybe I should incorporate that a little more next time. I like the revolver as the go to because of its rate of fire, uh, and we can take out either one big guy or two little guys or regular guys. Uh, maybe I need to show how many shots do we get before we have to. Okay, it's a bolt action, we get five shots before we have to reload. All right, could be worse. Health is full. Full I have batteries. to make my way up this mine shaft in order to go on. Great. Maybe the machinery could help me with that. All right. Well, let's see. Nice. Look at us being all smart. Understanding how to use this machinery. Surprise, this stuff still works. Nope. 
or what? Okay, so what if I do this? No, so I do need it right here. Okay. Nice. This is kind of cool. I like that there's a bit of a... some change in pace. Didn't need a tetanus shot after all that. Look at all that rust on there. I'm not afraid for my life from the shadows and the darkness. I'm afraid of my life from tetanus. Ah, uh, okay. And that goes up. Nice. Kind of... Kind of fun. Ah, there you go. Machine's like, make up your mind! I don't even think I needed to do that. Nice! Look at us! Whoa, it looked like it was daytime for a second. But it switched. Kick it. Yeah. We're strong. We can go down that way. Go up this way. We might have to go down, but I do want to see what's up here. Or... Do go this way. A lot of light that we can use, uh, which is good and fine and all, but I want some more revolver ammo. Oh, there you go. Lightning flashed behind the windows of Cauldron Lake Lodge. Tor Anderson laughed and held the steel hammer above his head. Nurse Sinclair was trying to calm him down without success. Tor grinned. Ooh, yikes. Somebody new to deal with? A lot of characters we don't know yet. Or that we haven't really talked to or learned a ton about yet, I guess. Pretty sure. Go down this way. Oh, we have to take a cart over. Yep. Or a little trawler. No, 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 no. And y'all suck. I think I hate the birds most, actually. I believe I do. Oh, great. Another cable car. Just great. Yeah, and you already know those birds are going to be hitting us when we cross that. Uh, we're full on batteries. All right. Maybe we die. Maybe we don't. We have enough flares to get us across, if nothing else. Where are y'all at? Unless it gets stuck, like, in the middle. It could do that. I hope it doesn't. Coming, uh, come back. I'll fight you. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa! Chill. I just want to get across.
Take the long way. So they one shot normal guys. It's good to know. Okay, darkness is getting serious about killing us. Hey, finally some revolver ammo. And a checkpoint, always good. Just waiting to, yep. Ow! Ow. Their aim is incredible. Just keep going along, chugging along. Oh, there's a light. Ooh, I like how that works, because you can... You can run around a lot of enemies if you want. It just kind of depends on what approach you want to take. And I feel like if we want to make sure we have enough ammo and stuff for the bosses, that's the best way. Some of them you have to fight, or you have to kind of clear out a little hole for you to run through, but... I do like that you have that option. Alan. Going, bud. Don't look down. Look down. Holy crap. Oh no, the game's like, no, you're gonna look down. Oh, dude. Look at how calmly we just handled all that. Wasn't there? Yep, Thermos. That's where it is. Okay. Into the darkness we go. Into the further. Okay. Go this way. Oh, thank you. Maud had checked all of Stucky's rental cabins. There had been no sign of the wakes. It was dark when he'd found their car parked at the end of the road by Cauldron Lake. It made no sense. They must have taken a wrong turn, but there was no sign of them. Okay, so Mott works for somebody. So no matter what... This wasn't going to be good, this trip here. Something was playing for Alan and his wife, no matter what. Ooh, random piece of wood, all right. Kick it. Kick it. Stop it. 
pull it. Creepy gate. Creepy gate. Oh! How do I get the permit? Ah! Creepy. You talked to me on... Curse you, Thomas. Yikes. That is pretty horrifying. Shotgun ammo. I don't have a shotgun. The flares. Hunting rifle ammo. Okay, so it's given us a little bit of everything. I didn't see a shotgun for us to use. I guess we'll just... I mean, we'll pick it up anyways, but we're just not going to get to use it, I guess. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I appreciate how it always kind of reveals like this. Alright, big boy. You and me. Oh, you brought a friend. Jeez! Oh, he dodged. Very nice. And we can dodge, too. What a clean kill. That felt pretty good. Is that everything? Right here? No. Alright. I'm glad we had all those flares, because what did we use? Like, three of them? Oh, okay. So, were we supposed to jump across there, maybe? Alright, guess so. We could go down that way. I want to get this thermos first. Thought I forgot about you. I'm never going to leave coffee behind. The settings here are really cool. And kind of going back to what I said a second ago, whenever a lot of enemies drop... I could see Cauldron Lake. Oh. I thought I could make out the spot where the island and the cabin had been. There was a light near it. It had to be a boat. Nice. But going back to, like, whenever enemies surround you or jump out it, and it kind of takes all of them in, the camera does for you, that's pretty nice. That is helpful. I was close now. I had to... I tried to hold on to Alice, but her form melted away. I was losing control. Dr. Hartman stood in her place. I wanted to hit him. No. I dreaded what I would find. Wait! Are you? Wait! Hey, I'm here! I'm coming! No! Get away! Sorry! Please, please! The boss didn't know who he was messing with! I didn't know! I swear, I didn't know! We don't have his wife! We don't know where she is! She's probably drowned! We just said we had her to make a play ball! Oh. He never 
or had her. Uh oh. What a fall! Somebody rescued us. Wow. That was pretty interesting. So the kidnapper does not have Alice, which makes sense. I don't know why I really believed it as hard as I did, but that, you know, it had to have been the darkness the whole time, I guess. But why is the darkness going after these people, too? It's like, is it trying to help Alan in some ways, or is it doing it just because it wants Alan all to itself? That one makes more sense to me. But still, really cool progression so far, and I'm liking how the story's unraveling. I guess we're going to learn more about maybe Nightingale, Agent Nightingale, and the Doctor. Dr. Hartman afterwards, so we'll see what happens then. But I want to thank you for joining the charge today. If you haven't, please consider subscribing. It helps the channel out a lot, and it means the world to me. I want to thank you, and I will see you on the next battlefield. Till then.